Hello, everyone. My name is Roman Slutkowski, and I'm a very proud industrial and systems engineer uh, holding bachelor's and master's degrees uh, in, uh, in industrial engineering. I wanted to take just a few minutes to share with you my journey as an ISE and why it's helped me and shaped me to become the person that I am. Uh, I uh, was always intrigued by engineering and when I was applying to colleges uh, I was really not that enthusiastic about some of the more traditional engineering disciplines like mechanical engineering or civil or electrical or chemical and I, I was really looking for something that was a little more interdisciplinary and so when I was introduced to industrial and systems engineering I realized aha this is the place for me because I get to apply that level of rigor and discipline creativity and analyze business processes, optimize systems, look at broad based systems, understand impacts across organizations. And uh, that has served me very, very well. I uh, was fortunate to have had a, a, a very long career with a company many of you will be familiar with, uh, FedEx Corporation. Uh, my last 12 years with the company, I was a senior officer of the company and was able to understand how to apply technology to uh, improve productivity, reduce cost, and enhance customer experience, which is a really cool thing that IEs can do. Uh, I was also fortunate enough to serve several tours on the Board of Trustees uh, at the Institute of Industrial and Systems Engineers, our professional organization, uh, which was extremely rewarding uh, as it allowed me the opportunity to interact with uh, engineers, industrial and systems engineers from across the globe. Um, so my, uh, my, my pitch to you all is if you're interested in a challenge, you want to learn more about how you can improve small systems, large systems, integrated interdisciplinary systems, IE may be just a ticket for you. Uh, and I hope that it inspires you and provides you on as fulfilling a career as I have been fortunate enough to experience. Thank you all very much.